Hi, I'm Linda Hutchinson. Today I'm going to show you how you can decorate a wooden letter with scrapbook paper. Now, I just took a sheet of paper that would match the decor of the room that I wanted to hang the letter in. And I just simply traced roughly the um, outline of the letter. And I cut that out. Then I covered the surface of the letter with Mod Podge. You can use any kind of decoupage medium. And I did that part ahead of time because in the interest of time it had to dry. Now that I have this securely on here, what I started to do was to trim off the excess. Um, because I traced it to this, but I want it to just be on this um, top part and have the beveled part of the wood exposed. So I started just gently taking the sand, sanding block and I wanted to have kind of a shabby chic sort of look. So I am just gently sanding off that edge and peeling away the excess. And if it doesn't always come smoothly the first time, you just do a little bit more. I'm just going to keep working around the edge of the letter until I remove all of this excess paper, revealing the nice beveled detail work underneath. Now, there's a little clumping going on over here. I think some of the decoupage medium clumped over there a little bit, so I'm just gonna give it a little extra sanding. Once I'm done removing the excess, then I'm going to take a little bit of a brown ink to give it kind of an antique -y look on the wood. You can use paint, whatever's your preference. I just like the, the ink because it gives that shabby chic kind of vintage look with uh, a very simple application. And it doesn't take that long to dry. So now I'm gonna set that aside. I'm just gonna take the ink pad and just kind of go along the edges to give it a little bit more of a vintagey look. Again, whatever kind of look you're going for, if you want something a little more modern looking, you can just paint the wood. Whatever it is you prefer, you can leave it the way it is. I just kind of like that vintagey look. Um, once this dries, which I won't be able to do right now because it'll take a little time, I would suggest going over the entire thing again with some decoupage medium to seal it so it will stay better and the, and the uh, paper will have a nice sheen to it. Or you can use a matte decoupage medium if you prefer, but it'll you know be easier to dust and keep nice. And um, that's how you can decorate a wood block with scrapbook paper. My name is Linda Hutchinson and thank you so much for joining me. Bye-bye.